guys. So you've seen that uh, Candy and the kids and I went out to the uh, barn place where the fallen down barn was and we uh, collected our piece of wood here. Um, what I've done since then is I measured the uh, barn beam that's gonna go over the fireplace to uh, five foot long. So it's five foot, it'll fit on our mantle. And we, uh, we cut off the edges to, uh, to make it foot fit. So um, first time doing this, so this is kind of a learned, new learning experience. So we went to Lowe's, we picked up a chisel because on the edge of this, we cut this, we want to kind of mark it up a little bit, probably sand the edges to kind of clean it up so someone's not getting a sliver. And then we got uh, three different types of oil. We got a tongue oil finish, we got a Danish finish, and a teak oil finish and I bought three because I wasn't sure what candy was gonna like so I figured let's try three see which one she likes and we'll go with that so we got these applicators they're staining pads that we'll use on the wood uh, of course your handy dandy safety glasses when we're uh, doing some sanding so I'm gonna do two types of finishes I kept the we're gonna practice on these because we don't want to ruin this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do two types I'm gonna sand the spot and stain it and then I'm going to just leave it as it is and stain it and see what she likes better at that point. So always got to wear your safety glasses. So we're going to start with the tongue oil finish first which is low gloss and we're going to apply a little bit here and it's going to give us a kind of a finish. We may have to wait till it dries out a little bit. So the next one we're going to use is a teak oil finish. Put that on here. It looks almost the same, doesn't it? Now we're going to try the Danish oil. Again, it all kind of looks the same. Tainted wood, which I think we're going to get a different, different look here. So what's your conclusion? They all look the same. They all look the same. So while that's drying, I'm gonna use the sander here to kind of clean up these edges that I cut off. This is called a hand-hewn wood. And what the hand-hewn is, is that actually kind of gives you that little chipped texture on the sides to look like it was hit with an ax. So we're gonna kind of do that a little bit here on these edges. All right, so Candy determined she likes the darker color, so we're not gonna sand all this down like this because it turned too much orange, even though it does show a little bit more of the wood grain. So I'm just gonna lightly hit this to kind of break down any sharp edges so we don't get splinters. So I'm just going over this really lightly. I'm done putting the oil all over it and now we're just gonna wait for it to dry out and see what the finished product looks like. Alright, so hi everyone. What? Alright, so hi everyone, it's Carly and I just got home from school and I'm making some mac and cheese because Blake is not home because I'm pretty sure he's at workouts and Chase is not home because Friday and Thursday we have exams and Chase won't be here Friday because he has a wrestling tournament to go to so he has to stay after school today and make up his three exams that he has to do which is going to take like three hours so I get to be not home alone but away from my annoying brothers. I'm, I was also going to check if Dance Moms is still going on because I'm seeing all these things that people are posting where it's like spoiler alert, Bren has a solo at Nationals. But I thought they already went to nationals, so I'm a little confused, so I'm gonna, after I'm done making my mac and cheese, I'm going to check if, if Dance Moms is still going on and my tongue really burned. So poor Sasser, watch her back leg, she doesn't want to put it down on the counter. One time it happened before where it bothered her a lot, so we have a little pill she for her. <laughs> I don't know. Why'd you put such a big piece of I cheese? Well, I didn't... Did yeah. she get the pill? Should I give her another one? No. Well, I don't know where it could have went. All right. She gets just a quarter of the pill twice daily. 
and it's like an anti-inflammatory oh, pill oh my God. to uh, let the other dogs have a small piece to help with her knee, or not her knee, what would it be called? What? Like her joint, I guess. I don't want her to bite me. <laughs> Did you give each of the pups yeah. a little piece of cheese? Then why are they crying? Probably because they're jealous. All right, well I gotta go get Chase. He just texted me, he's ready to get picked up already. <laughs> There's the cute little boy waiting for his mommy. There he is. So, how was your test? I don't know. Which one did you have to take today? I took my Oh, you did? The English? Yeah. Was it hard? No. Oh, did you finish it in like five minutes? No, I stayed after. I know. Oh, you got to start it right away? Pretty like, much. oh, okay. I thought that the after school thing didn't start till three. So, Carl and I are going shopping today. Do you want to go and get a couple new things for vacation? Well, I miss wrestling. Oh, shoot. I forgot you had wrestling. Is this your last week? It's my last day. Oh, your last day, even. Yeah. So, even next week, though, you still go do Greco? Yeah. Just not like every day? All right, then I'll have to take you one day, which will be fine because just you and I can go by ourselves then. Because Carly just needs um, probably like a couple more pairs of shorts and bathing suit bottoms or a different bathing suit, whatever she decides, and a pair of dressy sandals. And then what would you like to get? I need shorts. I thought you weren't allowed to take those to school. The people are making them out of like zip ties and they take things out of their scooters. Oh really? Yeah. And those can like cut people because the zip ties are like sharp. Oh my gosh. Are they getting in trouble for having those? Yeah. But I still do. You spend it in class? Do you yeah, know any this. do you know any tricks? No. No. It. So it's time to get dinner ready. I cooked up this teriyaki chicken, added some mushrooms in it and the more I mix it it's starting to fall apart. I have some rice boiling, brown rice. And I'm gonna steam some broccoli to add to it. And I just wanted to show you guys, I've been still drinking water. No pop all week. And today I started adding these to my water. They're little packets of Crystal Light. They're like a single serving. You just add it to your cup. And mix it in. And this is the raspberry lemonade. It's really good. So here's what it looks like. And this time, Carly's eating her own dinner, aren't you? All right, so here's Ken's final product on our mantle. I actually really like the way it turned out. I think it turned out pretty nice. It's still starting to dry. That's why in some areas it looks darker than others. But yeah, it's looking pretty nice. So he said if it wasn't dark enough, he could stain it a little bit darker, but once these darker areas dry, I think it'll look pretty nice. All right, so we're headed to JCPenney. We're not gonna like go through the whole mall and stuff again. We've already gone to probably most of the stores that would have bathing suits that Carly would like. Um, I've actually always had really good luck at JCPenney, so hopefully they have a lot for Carly. Really disappointing news. Blake was supposed to take his driver's test tomorrow and the test guy called Ken and said that he is a sick kid or something's going on with this kid and he needs to reschedule. Blake is just all upset about it. He's just like he saying, yeah, he just wanted to get it over with and he's like, you know, you know all complaining about it and I told Ken like it's a good experience for him because this is how things go in real life not everything always works out the way that you want it to and when you have something important like the schedule then your mind is like stressed out probably thinking you know worried that you're gonna be taking the test or whatever and uh, yeah so now he gets to worry about it a little bit longer unfortunately so Right, Jesse Penny's not quite having as many as what I thought. That's cute. That's pretty That's cute. It's kind of like a tank top style. Medium. She only found one pair of black bottoms to go with the Target top. And of course they're small, so they're probably going to be too big, but she's going to try them. So, do they fit? Hallelujah, so we finally have a black bathing suit. 
All right, so now we're trying on some dressy sandals so she can wear sandals with I dresses told you I wear mine. instead of boots. Those are cute. You like those? They didn't have rose gold in nine, though, did they? Mm -mm, you have eight and a half. I can't believe you wear a size one size smaller than me. What if your feet end up even bigger than mine? I know, that's what everyone said. <laughs> How tall are you? And I said 5'4 because I'm 5'3 and a half. And I was like, no, you're not. I was like, yeah. <laughs> maybe. This is the maybe pile. Maybe pile. Oh, right. I sat in the box. At least this is going better than bathing suit shopping. <laughs> they look too wide. I mean, too skinny. They just don't look very good on your feet. I actually don't like those. You don't like them anymore? You picked them out. I know, put them on. They're cute. And then you just zip them up in the back. You don't have to undo the buckles. Oh no. Mm. And you can tighten the things around the ankle if you need yeah, to. Okay. I don't like. You don't like them? Uncomfortable. Should I get white and gold? If you think you're going to wear them that much. Which one's you like better? Mm, probably the white will probably match more. Be salty. So I'm getting these shoes and Carly has to try them on too to be a copycat. I'm showing you how good I am. How good you are? Oh jeez. Those look really cute with the socks on. Look. What if I was this tall? What if I filmed you this up close all the time? <laughs> Ready? I could do a dance to them. Totally <laughs> flings off at the judges. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Alright, let's go. Look, I can do wings in them. <laughs> Oh, it's slippery. Oh, yeah. My signature dance move. How do you do them on this floor? What if you got those shoes and we both wore them when we dressed up at night? Night? When we go to dinner, when we wear I our think dresses. I'm 17 when I have these on. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Alright guys, so now we are in Target because we took back all of Carly's bathing suits except the top to go with the black bottoms. Oh, and she found something for her room already. Show them what you get picked out for your new room that I told her to keep in a bag until we moved. She's like, no! Everybody tell her, everybody tell her in the comments that she should keep it in the bag until we move. So it stays yeah. nice and new. Shaggy's gonna lay It's on so it. soft. You know you're copying off me because that's the color I want in my new office. Well, it's not your new So color actually, your when you get bored with it, then I can put it in my office. Now, me, on the other hand, I am getting a tiny little okay. fan for my nightstand because I use the fan to sleep with because I like the noise. Our ceiling fan's actually pretty quiet. So, and the one I have is like my breaking. Confidence? It's making really, really weird noises. Anyways, so we just met Chloe, a fan, and got our picture taken. <laughs> I just waved to her, she was standing there again. So hi, Chloe. Um, and anyways, we are leaving Target and we're gonna stop at Chick-fil-A only because Carly wants to get a yogurt parfait. Anyways, I won't be getting anything because I've been doing good all week. Still no pop. I did have a headache yesterday and today. That's gonna be our I've had to take Tylenol for my headaches. We are ending our video here for the day because it's getting pretty late. We've seen that video. Anyways, question of the day is what is your favorite thing to shop for at Target? Mine is probably stuff. stuff for the house, yeah. Same, same. Mine is glue. No, I'm kidding. Stop. This is my new backdrop. So bye, that's it for today. <laughs> Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up this video. And the question of the day, we just told you, so bye. Bye.